All right, so let's talk about uh, the IRA yeah. language. So last Thursday, big success. They took all that IRA language out of the uh, new bill. So yay! Yeah, we're really and, and for about people that. who weren't familiar, they had introduced IRA language that mostly targeted self-directed IRAs, right. um, disqualifying them from being considered accredited if the person who owns the IRA or is the benefit beneficiary of the IRA is accredited. So they were trying to take that away, which they removed that. And our, we were talking with John Heyer um, at, our, at our last mastermind. And basically he was like, they had to educate all of these. Teach them what IRAs even Cause, were. Cause half of them didn't even know what an IRA yeah, was. That's, yeah. that's what uh, Jeff Watson said. Uh, yeah. And and we need to thank Jeff Watson, John Heyer, Bob Repass. They had a whole group of, of hardcore investors, and they're in all different types of investing. But they went to Washington, mm -hmm. sat down in front of the senators. And I mean, they took a week out of their life. They actually took a lot more than that because they were working behind the scenes as well. But right. they they really sacrificed for all of us investors to go in there and and um, lobby for us yeah. and, and make sure that that self-directed IRA stuff was taken out of mm -hmm. that bill. I mean, there are companies, Quest, Camaplan, American, uh, American IRA. IRA. There's so many rocket dollars, so many yeah. good IRA companies out there that would have been seriously hurt. Um, not to mention the, us, the, yeah, the individuals. Yeah. yeah. Regular, yeah. you know, Joe well, Smith, we've well, been I mean, in trouble. Think about how many funds, like accredited funds there are in the nation. I wouldn't even know where to begin to, to, to enumerate how many there are, but that have self-directed IRA that money have, in it. that have self-directed IRA money in them. I mean, mm -hmm. it's, so it's probably, I mean, it has to be thousands and it could be tens of yeah, thousands. I don't and know. All of that would have had to be emptied out. So, it was yeah. just ridiculous. Yeah, you would have taken billions of dollars out of the real estate business. Business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, that's how we survive. That's, that's how this business rolls. If we didn't have self-directed money, uh, whether it's IRA, HSA, ESA, um, what, I know there's one more, um, I forget, I forget what it is now, but if we didn't have self-direct money to work with, we would be so far behind where we are now because sure. the lending would not be in the situation that it's in having non-qualified lenders and funds and REITs and oh, yeah. all anybody other than government backed loans. Well, I mean, the, the thing is it's, it's the, it's the pure uh, freedom to, to invest how you want to, to direct that investment and build and maintain your own wealth and right. not put it in someone else's hands because you, because there's no other option. That's right. Like that's, that's the beauty of what a self-directed IRA is. It allows you to control and manage your financial freedom. Because you do have the common sense to make a right decision. Absolutely. And that's what government doesn't believe is that. Um, well, what, what uh, it drives me absolutely up the wall. It's like you have to be a creditor. You know, people are too dumb to use self-directed IRAs because, the, you know, they might lose money. Okay. Can anyone... Raise your hand if you've ever lost money in the stock market. Yeah, exactly. Like, exactly. What's the, I don't. Do and you have to way, be accredited to go? With, security going. Yeah, like do you have to be accredited <laughs> to invest in the stock market? That's no. right. No. So, I, like, I'm like, hmm, strange. That's right. That's right. It's it's just you well, know. Well, that surprised me that the government uh, folks didn't know uh, about the self-directed retirement account because there's only 5% of the population knows about them either. So it, it's amazing. And it, it's, it's not knows about them, that 5% that has have them. Well, they've heard of self-directed uh, IRAs, but <clears throat> there's a big misnomer. Uh, most people have a self-directed IRA. They, they have it with a stock manager and that person says, here's five stocks you can invest in. <laughs> your, that's your self-directed. Yeah, yeah. Pick which one do you, yeah. <laughs> which one do you want? Yeah. But people invest in self-directed retirement accounts because they have the ability to invest in stuff they know. That's yeah. right. And most everyone that has a retirement account, I would say, especially a self-directed, own a home. Yeah. yeah. And they know about real estate. Yeah.